Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Topps Tier 1 Baseball 4 box pick your team number 3 from jazbeescasebreaks.com On a Chew Tuesday final 4 boxes of the case that we popped open yesterday and it was TJ Poyer, last spot mojo with the Blue Jays Thanks everyone, this is a uh, Chase the Mantle break as well So Rex has a trivia question for us Name the player with the highest batting average of the first 162 games at 323. And it's a trick question because Ichiro, in his first 157 games, had a 350 batting average. But maybe didn't, didn't do well at the beginning of the next season, so it, it lowered, lowered it below 323. All right, what's, what, it's not Ken Griffey Jr. It's a junior in the AL. But not not Ken. There's Anthony Rizzo, seven out of twenty-five, Cubs edition, going to Ed P. Kevin's guessing Sandy Alomar Jr. And we've got Jason Hayward, another Cub, two twenty-nine out of three ninety-five. Right, I know. I, I I already mentioned that. That it's a it's kind of a trick question because Eacher only played 157 games, and I guess the next handful of games after that was below 320. Got him below 323, so it wraps around his season. Roberto Alomar Jr. Maybe Chris and Kevin are saying that. Here's Luke Voigt to 299. Tristan and the Yankees. Vlad Jr. Maybe. No, no to all of these. I feel like this is this sounds like a question we have to fact check Rex on. Are you telling me that Ichiro hit 350 the season before? And then in games 58, 59, 60, 61, 62? It those five games were bad enough that got him below 350 over 162? There's DJ LeMayhew for the Yankees at 395. That'll be for Tristan. That's guy, well, he loves iron, so yeah. So it's got to be Cal Rukin Jr., Stephen K. saying. Really? Mm, I don't know. You must have worded the question weirdly, Rex, because Cal Ripken Jr.'s first 23 games, 100, 128 batting average, and then the second season, he had 160, and that's a 160 games, and that's a 264 batting average. I guess unless it counts, well, minus the 23 games, so I guess maybe unless the first 140 games was... We got Fred McGriff, the crime dog, 17 out of 40. It's for the Braves. That's going to be for David M. You got it from Stat Muse? We got Patrick Corbin, 17 out of 299 for the Nationals. I mean, that question, you, I, I don't know if you maybe you were the question with Weird Rex because, yeah, from 128 to 264, that doesn't make 323. 
using back of the napkin math for your first 162 games. There's Ronald Acuna Jr. 395. So I think that's not correct. David M. with the Braves. And the autograph before I show you the expired redemption is going to be Josh Hader. Brewers edition to 299. Brian with the Brew Crew. Your redemption. Oh, man. Mike Trout, Shohei Otani, dual autograph. Expired in 2022. David M. with the Angels. I think they got to do something for you on this. I feel like Topps has been pretty good about honoring these expired redemptions. We'll see. Obviously, we'll still send it to you. Let us know how, how that goes. Hopefully, you'll get it. They have to, right? They said 10-year extension on redemptions. So, so I hope. Yeah, Brett, but I don't know. I mean, that much time goes by. Isn't, isn't there like a... I'd be nervous about it. I'd be like, you still have this, right? <laughs> Would be my first question. We got Bryce Harper to 3.99. 3.95 for the Phillies. That's going to be for Jim. We got the big hurt Frank Thomas piece of the jersey 330 or 35 out of 399 it's for David and the White Sox and there's Will the Thrill Will Clark 4 out of 10 silver ink autograph they're announced hmm see that that's uh, Mark is saying, but that 10-year extension starts in 2021 or 2022. But for a card like that, here's a, this one's for Todd and the my rivals, the Giants. And then we got Matt Beatty, 54 out of 299 for the Dodgers, David M. So yeah, well, David, give him a call. Contact them for a card of that magnitude. It'd be kind of bad PR not to not to honor it, right? So hopefully they will, unless they don't have it, I guess. But you got to check for a card like that. You got to put in the legwork on it. All right, that was the break. Let's gather everybody's names. Robert down to Todd. Everybody in between. New dice, new list. This is a chase the mantle break. So let's randomize all of your names. Name on top after one and a four or five times. We'll get an entry. One. Two, three, four, and once more, fifth and final time. Again, a lot of sad faces here, but there will be tons of opportunities to try to get yourself an entry. All right, so after five, five sad times, but name on top, happy times for James. There you go, James. You got an entry into our big promo. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking us, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we'll see you next time for the next break.